Hey, what's up everybody? Um, so today I'm going to be showing you guys how to get the Yogbox mod pack for 1.7.3 Minecraft on Mac. This was a request from Ethan Terry TV, and he wanted to um, see how to do this. And when I went on YouTube to find out uh, if anybody else had done this um, uh, kind of tutorial, I really didn't find a lot. So, you know, it actually is a good idea that I'm probably doing this. So what you guys want to do first is open Google Chrome and or whatever browser you're using. And I'll have this link pasted in the description. And you want to go to the link that I have up here. This is going to take you to Mediafire. Uh, whoa, I don't want pop-ups. Mediafire.com. And uh, you're going to have this right here where it says uh, Yogbox uh, 1.7.3 v3.zip. And um, click here to start download from Mediafire. So you're going to want to get that and it's going to be downloading and it says about 30 seconds uh, left so I've already downloaded this so what I'm going to go ahead and do is cancel this and close down um, Chrome but see I already have downloaded so what you're going to do is it's going to become a zip file you're going to want to take the zip file and you're going to want to uh, basically uh, double click it. It'll ex automatically extract the file and then you're going to want to open Yogbox. And then it's going to have all these. You can read about the mods here and you can read a little bit more about the mods here. What you're going to want to do is you're going to want to click on the Yogbox installer.jar. You can go ahead and close out of this window now. Now what you want to do is click next. It says you already have mods installed into the Minecraft mods folder. Yes, I do already have mods on there, but there are already some Yogbox stuff. So go ahead and click yes if it shows up yes on yours. Uh, if um, it doesn't, it should just prompt you to continue. What you're going to have here is all this stuff. Um, instead of having to click it all by one by one, go ahead and click full install. And then it'll select everything that you want to install. And then go ahead and push next. And it's actually pretty fast, so it's just going to go through a list here and then you can see it's installing all of these little different mods and then it's going to say finished and then what you're going to want to do is you want to push done obviously that'll close and then what you want to go ahead and do is open minecraft okay and then as normal just push just push login and as you can see it's a little different login now and you have minecraft miners welcome and then it has a little Yogbox thing over here. And then what I recommend you guys do is it comes with two different um, texture packs. And uh, for the Yogbox to properly function and work with the stuff they've added to it, I suggest you guys click on the third and last texture pack. And what you want to go ahead and do is uh, pick a world. I already have this one created. It's called Yogbox. Um, generate any kind of world you want. And you can go ahead and push play selected world. And as it's loading the level, you can see that it's a little different than before. So, uh, as you can see here, you spawn with an axe, and you also have a recipe book. What the recipe book does is it has basically every kind of recipe in Minecraft um, available, and it shows you how to make them, plus the new things from the yog box and you can walk around you see it generates people for you these are people in single player which is quite interesting these are uh, CPU um, generated players they're not actual real people you can see that the game uh, automatically generates uh, a little village for you and as you can see there's mo creatures uh, lots of different types of animals just running around um, you know uh, as you can see um, we have in the top right a mini map, which is much better than the actual map mod that they included in 1.7.3 from um, actually from Mojang itself. Um, so I hope you guys enjoyed this uh, little tutorial. It's very fast, very easy, very simple. If you guys have any questions, um, just let me know. I'll have all the links posted in the description below. So make sure to check that out. If you guys enjoyed this commentary tutorial, please let me know. Please give me a thumbs up or a thumbs down if you disliked it. Um, it would mean a lot if you commented, and even more to me if you subscribe. I could always use more subscribers. 
you know, who couldn't? So uh, thanks for watching, guys, and I hope to uh, hear from many of you within the near future. All right, see you guys later.